Walmart now guys, I'm getting some water, so that's what I'm doing, but yes, everybody in the business is still have to wear face masks, but I'm picking up some water to take home, if I drink nothing but water here, I don't drink no sodas, no junk, well, I pick up some juice, I ain't had no juice in a while, let's see how this goes, it's supposed to be 100% orange juice, with vitamin D and some calcium, so. <laughs> what is, oh yeah, I wish I could buy that too, Rick. You said some rifles. <laughs> I just saw what you said. That would be nice. What tickets you talking about? But I'll be back. Checking out now, it was $24. That's Thank you, ma'am. Have a good day. You too, ma'am. Alright, you too. Bye-bye. Hi, guys. I'm going in here to the vitamin shop to see what they have. I normally get certain things that I need from here. Like, I used to get, like, Moringa powder, Spirulina, all that from here. Let's see what they got for me today. I had not been in here in years, but let's just see. I will be back. Oops. I forgot my mask. I'll be back, guys. Be right back. Okay, I'm here where the kids used to go to school. Their last school when they left here and we moved to Africa. It's up in this area, guys. Not too far from the house. Around the corner. Not that far at all. They actually built a whole lot back here. Oh my gosh, these apartments they done put. They had some of these up already but not many before we left because the um rick used to actually practice football back here on the on both sides really this is all new this is coming into west creek uh school area guys rick used to uh, practice on that field over there now they have houses or apartments over there now guys they didn't like us practicing over there either so it's all good but now they have a lot of apartments back here. Gee Whitakers, you see one field is still available over there. Actually, I'm gonna start over here. This is actually the elementary school. The first school I showed you where they was they first went before they was rezoned. This is actually the second one, one of the second ones. This is for the smaller kids when they was young. Our last, well, our four smaller ones went here. This is actually the elementary they have here. They had just built these when we had moved over there and you know when it was rezoned. But the, again, this is the elementary, elementary school here. Then of course across the street are is the middle school. The I think they all went to this middle school. All of them except I think except for Rick. Rick had went straight to high school once he finished over there I, I think i'm not for sure about middle school but i know well actually i think he did go to the middle school so all of them went to these school all the children attended the schools over here because they had just rezoned everything and they all went to elementary then middle then high i don't think rick went to the elementary i think rick went straight to the middle school but yes that was the elementary right there and now this is the middle school that all the kids went to right here I think Raheem was in this one getting ready to go to high school right before we moved to Africa so this and Rikita they all all of them went to the middle school so this is the middle school every kid in the house went to this one so and I 
and I think the high school was just Rakita, Baby, Nadia, and Rick went to the high school. And this is one of the fields Rick used to practice on too. Back here, is, uh, he was the coach. He was the coach and he practiced on this field with his boys. So I think this is new here. They didn't have these when the kids was here. They just put these here. I don't know where they are for. Maybe for, I don't know, more learning. I don't know for the something. But this is the middle school back here. How big, uh, how convenient, huh? What is that note? I don't know, but again, middle school, real big school for, for the kids here in the South. They even had a track and field over here, but they used the high school field. And this is the high school over here. I'm gonna go over there too. This is their field where my sons used to play football over there on the big one, the high school. They're probably gonna be excited to see this when I get back home. But yeah, they actually went to school here. They had track and field where all of them, well, baby, Naughty, Rick, and uh, Rakita went here. Doug was on his way, but we had just moved to Africa, so he didn't attend, which is the last child. But I got to see Baby and Rick run track here. And of course, this is the school buses that they use to pick them up each day and drop them off. How convenient for them, huh? Anyways, there's the track and field there. Like I said, we had a lot of times here playing football with the kids. A lot of memories. It's all on video. <laughs> My husband used the coach. We had a lot of fun. While it lasted, like I said, the school bus is there. And this is the high school here. That the kids used to attend. Like I said, Rocking was the only one. He's the last kid. with them baby and Nadia is I forgot what they do something back there with wrestling doing something with the I forgot what they used to do but anyway yeah that's what they they all went to school here a lot of memories here with them I used to pick them up sometimes but this is the baseball field where they play softball Miss Nadia she got uh, records here she was the first to hit it over the field smack it cross over the field she played fast pitch softball over there and she have a record inside the school on the stand so her and uh, baby used to play softball here and volleyball and uh, some of everything else here but again this is their memories here of the school the elementary high school and middle school that they used to attend here get in trouble all the time Miss Nadia but I'm sure it's nothing but memories now <laughs> and I think they love the memories so it was all good while it lasted but we got other things going on now guys and I'm sure they well probably miss everything but it's okay when they'll come back here one day and visit on their own and See those memories again high school right there we got a lot of videos on on them in the middle school where mr james used to play fighting in the lunchroom always get in trouble talking about some 60 minutes fighting him and some boys playing in the lunchroom i mean in the bathroom and they always got in trouble had to pay for somebody watch that he broke one day that they were playing and he was accused of breaking a watch Cause the both were playing in the bathroom. I guess the little boy got in trouble and made James pay for that watch. And I made James pay for that watch myself. If you know what I mean. 
fighting in the bathroom. But again, this is it. The school they went to. Oh, yeah. A lot of memories with my babies. They all grown on me. Oh, well. We somewhere else making memories now, guys. All across the world. And I'm enjoying it. But anyway, I'll be back, guys. I got to go and pick up some other things. I guess one more thing is the uh, lawnmower belts. I'm having a hard time finding them. At least I don't want to pay no $17 for one. But I guess if I have to, he wants a five. But okay, we'll see. Maybe I could just get the size and bring it to him. We get him down there in Gambia. I got the size, but that size, the one at Rural King, that just so expensive, guys. But he the man, so I got to do what he says and do it. Do it right. I'll be back at you. I'll be home real soon, Mr. Red. Love you guys, and I'm out of here. Here's one of Kiki favorite stars, Plato's Closet. I'm at the mall, and there's your store, Kiki and Baby. <laughs> and Naughty liked it too. We used to clean this restaurant one day. We was cleaning this thing. And like 50 police came in there saying, what are you guys doing? What it look like we doing? We clean it, fool. Yeah. Coming in there because we was black on talking about we heard somebody was being robbed. Dude, you know ain't nobody being robbed. You just mad. I mean, it was like 50 police is in there. We had to clean all those things on top of that building right there, guys. See all them things? We clean hood grease crap. And that was a headache. I hated that job. But again, it got us through, guys. Mm -hmm. It's called Shogun. <laughs> Don't miss it at all. But yep, this is the mall again where I'm at. I'm just showing you different things that we used to do here, guys. There's a restaurant we used to clean in here. Oh my gosh, I hated this restaurant. It was so nasty. It was nasty. I forgot the name of it. Uh, I don't even know. I can't. Something bowl, chicken noodle bowl, something. But it was a Chinese place, and his hood was disgusting. I tell you, it was disgusting. We used to clean all the time back here. This is the food court right here, guys. We used to clean up in there, and we used to park right over there in that corner over there. Boy, that was many nights. And Rick hated that roof up there. <laughs> Man, them days was whew, harsh, especially around this time. It'd be cold. Sometimes it'd be freezing. Oh my God, that was the day, bad days. But hey, we made it through again, like <laughs> we always do. But yes, this is the mall. We cleaned so many whole restaurants up in this mall. We used to always be on top of that roof. That's one thing Rick used to hate. He could never find a ladder to fit up there. <laughs> But yeah, we had our times, and I might go in there and find me some earrings, some good earrings this time. I can't believe I gotta come here to buy me some gold earrings. I can't find them in uh, Gambia. They say I have to go somewhere else, uh, Senegal or somewhere. I went up there, we still didn't find no gold. And if we did, it was so expensive with somebody else's hand on it. But again, like I said, I'm going to find me some gold in Africa. And it's going to be some real good gold that I need. I need some of my ear, my earrings. I lost my other ones. I don't want to pay too much and lose it again. But again, let me go. They said to check in Best Buy to find me a phone. I'm trying to find Mr. Rick a phone, guys. His phone, he has, it works, works well, but the um, Wi-Fi button won't let him switch over. He can only use his data. That's bad, isn't it? We bought it there, but um, it's not a good. It's not good where he has to keep using his data. But it's okay. We're gonna make it. Anyway, let me park here, and I will be back. Bye. Oh wow! I didn't know I was still recording. I'm gonna have to <laughs> delete that out of there. Edit it. <laughs> But yeah, I'm going in here. It's called Best Buy. They said they have phones in here. Let's go see what I can find for Mr. Reed. 
I'll be back. And I'm sure my son looking for his, his truck. I done had it all day. I'm bringing it back. Hey, I just filled it up, though. He should be happy. <laughs> okay, I'll be back, guys. Well, I did find him a phone, and I actually found me something, too. It's something to hold the phone. A gimbal. <laughs> it was on sale, so I had to get it, guys. Everyone kept showing me what it was, so now we have one. I just hope it sits on top of my other tripod. It would help, but I don't. Time for me to go home now. I got one more place to check for the uh, lawnmower belt, and then we're... I'm finished, guys. I'll see you guys later. Look at those wheels, guys. That's just too big. <laughs> But that's where they like them down here in Tennessee. <laughs> oh wow, look at those hotels we used to clean. All those hotels over there, guys. All of those. We had the gas in, quality in. We cleaned so many, so many things here. It's just so many memories here. And no, I don't miss it. Heck. It's like just change, man. Hurry up. But yeah, we got a Chipotle that built that right before we moved. And I've never tried them. I don't want to try them. But anyway, I got one more place this garden place. Check on this lawnmower belt. Then I'm back at the house and hopefully see Gabby's mom tomorrow. I know been a while but I get through this we've been here for a couple I mean, I've been here for oh I think today is a week isn't it yeah it is a, it's been a week since I've been here yay I've survived the week but I'll be leaving very soon and I'll be so excited when I'm back on bag property guys i know you've been missing me i know mr rick is doing a great job he's hand, he's holding it down for you guys but i'll be back real real soon and right now i'm gonna turn this off because they got me in the middle of the room bye well i thought i was gonna turn it off we clean that big hotel right there we used to do all kinds of things over there. Heat and the um, floors, food and not, I mean, grease, degreasing rooms. We were busy over in that hotel. Let's go over here and see if this garden place still open here. Yeah, lawn, tractor and lawn, garden. That's where I need to go. TS, whatever you want to call it. Tractor Supply Company. That's where I'm going. See if I can find a belt for this uh, lawnmower we got here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This is where I'm going. It's called Tractor Supply Company. Let's see if they got any belts for our Troy built. Because the ones we keep buying down there, I mean, they're over there in the Gambia that keep breaking. See any uh, long tractors or none of it, but <laughs> one line pick up. I don't want to park there, so I'll park here, guys. Uh, let's see here. Okay, let's go in here and see what they got for us. I'll be back. I'm in here now. Let's go see if I can find the belts. This is where we used to come and get a lot of things. Where we used to clean hoods, all kind of stuff. We used to use that stuff. Ooh, look at this belt. How much is it? Twenty bucks. Ooh, Rick, look at that. That's a big say. I like that one. I wonder how much is it? Don't say a price on it. But I gotta get somebody to help me because I don't know what I'm doing here. I think you need that. We got one of these already, but we probably need a new one. That's a good one. 
I'm sure you will like this stuff. I know you're wishing you were here, Mr. Rick. Some good stuff in here. Mm. Let's go around and see what I don't see. Let's see. We got a lot of space over here. Hey, that'll be for your truck, Mr. Rick. <laughs> That's a big one. Now. Wish I could bring it back with me. That's a good one, too. But I don't like the color. Mmm. Yeah. Ooh, Nine hundred for that one. Mm -hmm. I'll be right back. I was coming to shop at Sam's Club. I went inside, but they didn't have no. I wanted just a food court with nothing open, so I'm out of here, guys. It did come. They have nothing going on, but they want you to spin, spin, spin. I didn't want to spend no money right now. And I wasn't real reapplying with my car because we're not here again. And I don't want to spend that $35 just to get the car we knew. So, Finn is out of here again. Mm -hmm. One more place and then we're, I'm on my way home. I'll see you guys later. They said these are dragon fruit. They're either three ninety nine. I think they're three ninety nine, and something else was two star fruit, Carambolo star fruit, two for four dollars. So I don't know what these things are, but I'm gonna ask them. They look different. Let me see what it is, and I'm gonna try it. Oh my gosh, sweet daddy, look at this here. A jackfruit they have in here. Oh my gosh. I wonder how much the thing costs. <laughs> Hell no, I ain't never seen a jackfruit in America. Oh my goodness. A jackfruit. Wow. <laughs> what? Oh well. Let me turn this off because I got some music on and mine got to be flagged. I don't know how I'm going to do it, but I can't believe they have a jackfruit here. This is my first time ever seeing it in America. Guys, I found some dry organic jackfruit. I'm about to try this. I've never seen this, but I'm going to try it. It says it's organic, unsweetened, and unsuffered. So let's see. I come in here for a lime, lime and I'm up here buying something else, guys. But I'm about to try this. I think this is dragon fruit, they say. And this jackfruit. I'm about to try it. I'll be back.